been low on confidence parts during this season. York City hopefully turning a corner. Brought down by Disarube and out to the space where Jay Casty, making his first start this season, kills it into the box from his left. No danger though. Simple clearance for corner and it's stuck from outside the box. It's stuck at George Sykes Kenworthy. It's Paul pulls in possession in their defence at the moment with Zach Johnson on this near side. Featherston comes across to support and the ball's on towards Hasty. Has he got the running on Paddy McLaughlin? Well, he yeah. has got the running. He's beaten Paddy squarely and he's slotted it in by the left-hand post and Hasty scores on his first start of the season. Yeah, well, he took that really well, didn't he? I know Paddy's not a left-back, but, you know, as soon as he got one-on-one -on -one with Paddy, I... I was, I was a little bit concerned because, like I say, it's not his natural position and he breezed past him, didn't he, really? And then you sort of thought, is he going to be able to finish? And to be fair to him, it was a good finish into the corner. But like I say... Shout out to Carl Barker, who is watching from a boat in Cape Cod, apparently. Hello, Carl. Oh, girl, good chance here. Kennedy, oh, nice layoff to Paddy McLaughlin. McLaughlin oh. decides to go for goal himself and that's where it goes too high. Watchdale was the previous biggest away attendance this season, but today will eclipse that. Plenty of home fans here as well making noise. Manny Disarube plays a 1-2 down the left and then feeds Crawford. Putting in from the left-hand side, Disarube makes the run, Crawford now has it in the D and he's yeah. had a shot and he's tucked it easily and carefully past Sykes Kenworthy, it's 2-0. He has and so much space wasn't there they seem to work it quite well to the left hand side and you were just sort of thinking that you know they're backing off a little bit here a bit too much and Crawford he just didn't need that second invitation did he once he got into the edge of the box he thought well I'm not getting closed down corner coming in from the left hand side for the Minster men to defend oh, God. oh dear there's a header that's oh. come off the post how unlucky was Crawford it's still not away and thankfully Featherstone Wallace, oh, lovely little flip by Manny Disarube could start off another important breakaway for Hasty. Hasty picks up the ball, 15 yards out, oh, gets it onto his right. Ooh. Good header out of danger in the end. It was important from Fallafield that. It's not fully away though. Hartley Ball is still with plenty of players forward. It's towards Disarube's Ooh. head wide. Never seen so many fans here. But one o'clock, half past one for both teams today. It's fantastic Ooh. to see Hartley Paul under. They're attacking again here oh. in that one. Well, trying to. It's been given though as a Hartley Paul free kick. Well, as long as it's two now, I believe we can really. We can get back in this. Corner comes to the far post. It's another chance to head it into the box. On the rises. Someone get it out of danger. Header from Wallace. Sykes Kenworthy comes out, doesn't claim. I think Dippo ended up heading that away. Really like a box on the rope at the, on the ropes at the minute. Unless we can get a goal for half time, it's going to be one of Ardley's biggest kind of half time yeah, tests. Really. I totally agree. Cordner. Oh, lovely ball again. Oh, indeed. Excellent. Perfect onto the feet of Fallerfield. It's a box. Oh, it's coming through to John Lewis. Two up now, and they're playing a free kick into the six yard oh. box. Sykes so Kenworthy can't hold it. Second time he catches this whilst rolling backwards. Then a burst of pace as he jets away down the left. Akinyemi's out supporting. Lays it off to, just behind Davis. A shame because if he had picked it up, there might have been a chance. This is a worry, isn't it, as we flood forward? This is the worry. It's Cook. Cook coming towards the left hand corner of the box. Fallerfield heading back to goal. He's played it infield and it's tucked in on the left-hand post and it's 3-0 to Pauls. Yeah, it was always going to be the, the worry, wasn't it, with the uh, the counter-attack and just absolutely did us on that, didn't they? And I think it's Nick, Nicky Feverston who's put that home. For me, the best player on the pitch so far this match. What a mare. What a nightmare for York City. Nicky Featherston in his 550th appearance of football. Inside right position, Kennedy. Fallowfield again. Is this the cross? Oh. No, trying a short ball again. How picks it up. 
Kennedy tries to shape the shoot. Green, that's a lovely one touch. She finds Zaki Niemi, he's really out wide left oh. at the moment. He's playing yes. it in there, oh. and it's just gone wide. How did that stay out? On a substitute here with uh, 12 minutes or so remaining. Cook, Cook is running it down the left corner of the boxes, Dia Sarube. To give himself more space, he takes it wider. Support from Cook once again. Dia oh. threads through Burton. Burton tries to go outside of Howen. Oh. He managed to do that, but he finds the side netting. But he's beaten Callum Howe there. To pre-season signing Dixon in goal. Oh, it's a mistake by Cordner. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear from Tyler Cordner. And the player running in with space here is Cook. He wants to make it oh. four, and it took Callum Howe rushing back to intervene. Mistake from Cordner. A little bit similar to the one against Chester. Corner comes in, oh. header from a few yards out. Bounces off Sykes, Kenworthy on the line. And I thought, wow, they must have a bit of a soft underbelly. You know, then I realised about the clean sheet record. He's been better second half, but... Corner far side, Corner, Corner with a near post header. Tyler Corner makes sure Hartlepool still haven't kept a clean sheet and gets a little consolation with one of those goals from the back. He scored many of last season for Aldershot. Joel Dixon gives the last kick of a very well-deserved victory for Hartlepool United. For York City... It has really, really, really not been our day for a game we look forward to for a long time between these two teams that were hoping to turn a corner. There's only one team that has done, and that is the guys from the northeast.